I'm Mike Beaudry and I'm a welder mechanic here for Little Flake Mining. I do a lot of maintenance, repair welding, fabricating, small stuff, big stuff. You know, sometimes we got to build custom tools. We build uh, certain parts for the equipment, certain parts of the wash plant. Keep up with the equipment breaking down, we need a good, reliable machine. I met the Big Blue 800 in May and I've used it almost every day this season. Whether it be to run a grinder or anything to a major fix like what we're doing on our D10. The first thing I noticed about the Big Blue was the dual power to be able to run the two welders off it at the same time. I had never seen that before so it was pretty interesting. We went in looking for a machine this uh, for this season, We Miller suggested the dual 800 and it's been a great fit for us because can, two people can be using one machine and having the air on it, it kind of you know, multi-purpose in one machine, it's worked great. If we want one welder or two welders on it, then that's all set, you know, and it's, it's things like that, it's just universal, right? Like you've got one thing that does it all. Being able to run two welders off of it is actually really nice because there's a lot of projects where it's just all hands on deck and that's when it comes in, in a lot of use. Yeah, it's quite often that we're on a big project. We're all, we're all, we all need to be fixing on one project at the same time. So Mitch and I'll fire up Big Blue and get it done fast. The 800 amps is nice for when you need the big power on one job, or you can split it down and run two welders up to 400 amps each. So it's uh, pretty versatile for what we're doing. Uh, the Big Blue 800 has uh, the air pack on it, which is nice. We use that every day. Like I say, it gives us a lot of power. We we do carbon cutting with it, we do lots of welding with it. We use it as a power source for the grinders, any electric tool that we have. You know, we don't have plug-ins just around the corner anywhere. On the bigger projects when I'm doing buckets or these D10 track frames, the suitcase is nice, the big blue handles them, it feeds them great once the settings are set properly. I prefer to use flux core, it's uh, one less tank that we have to drag around with us and keep with us. The flux core whole bar wire is it's very consistent. It's a smooth burning wire. The machine's been great, you know, it's performance and how it operates, it's weld smooth and it's been a really nice machine, what I've ran of it. The other thing I really noticed is that it's really good on fuel. It doesn't burn much fuel. Actually it runs out of fuel because we forget to fuel it because we never have to put any fuel in it. Haven't run out of power with it yet, so I think when that day comes it's time to go home. Mm -hmm.